hi guys welcome back in this uh, lumen video tutorial we are going to learn uh, what is the lumen why we use the lumen and what is the benefits of uh, lumen and how we can install this so let's get start so first is what is the lumen uh, lumen is the micro framework of the laravel so it's uh, pretty similar with the laravel just thing is different uh, is that there is a some functionality is less than to the laravel uh, let's say there is the Mm, no console uh, console part is not there and there is a no localization is a predefined so you can note the make commands by default and uh, there is a, a no no use of the blade templates and all so basically this is made for the api purpose so and in the another hand we can say that it's a very good for the microservices so what are the microservices uh, i am not going to details but in easy words you can say that when we have to grab the data from the many servers like a distributed service this is called the uh, uh, microservices so let's uh, continue with the lumen so uh, basically used for uh, apis and how we can install this so for let's uh, go with the documentation and after the installing we will see the uh, folder structure of the lumen so first of all you must have a composer so let's and if you don't uh, if you don't have the composer then don't worry uh, i'm going to uh, provide a link in the description box so you can easily watch this video and this is also my video and if you have any kind of confusing the uh, composer installation you can ask me in the comment box also so you can see that compo composer is already there so after the composer i have to use this command so uh, you can see that this is the y composer create project so you can directly go with that all right so i'm going to just clear this feed screen and just write here and after this uh, command i already installed a lumen pr project so we are not going to waste the time and uh, we will wait until it's going to be installed so i'm going to paste it for uh, I'm going to cut this command all right so uh, you can see that I already have the project in the same folder so you can if you want to see in the folder uh, directory structure you can uh, watch here so just go to the my computer and we are here also so you can see that this is a block directory and here all right so after that you need to use the uh, you need to serve it on a, a any particular port so that i'm going to paste this port and you can see that uh, there is the port listening is 8080 here and if you want to change this port you can also change here all right so let's uh, now see the folder structure here so in the folder structure you can see that this is all around the uh, laravel and if you are familiar with the laravel this is all kind of this the app file here you, you can see that the bootstrap is here public and resources all thing but some things are missing here you can see that uh, in the temp in the route there is a no api and the no console file is here and in the resource there is a no uh, localization is here in the view there is a no welcome.blade.php and there is a no config folder here also so how we will manage that for so the old config files are uh, managed in the app.php uh, files and all routes are written in the web.php uh, file all right so here you can see that this will telling you the version here so let's say i'm going to comment this and i'm going to just write here echo hello from lumen all right all right so if i'm going to make it post and going to comment it it will not going to work here but it will work from the postman why because this is the post request so i'm just op opening the postman from here here and you can see that okay I have to use the post request 
or you can see that hello from the lumen so we got it with the post also so you can use i think any also here okay so it will not support the any all right so post is here okay so this is the basics about how we can install this and what is the purpose of the lumen in the next video we will directly start with the apis and Firstly, we will uh, install the JWT token with the Lumen and after that we will uh, make the another APIs. Okay, so bye for now. Don't forget to subscribe our channel and like this video. And if you have any kind of question, you can ask me in the comment box also. So thanks guys. Thanks again for watching this video.